Hey guys, just a quick and easy video on how to wire your sub in normal, the normal way you do it, and the bridge way, the difference between them. Let's get straight into it. All right, so the amp that I'm running here um, is a V12 DC straight 1000 watt four channel. Okay, these are your main types of amps. You're gonna have a mono block, which pretty much means one channel. Uh, you're gonna have two channel amps and four channel. All that means is it gets the, whatever the power of the amp is, and it divides it by the channel. If you have a 1000 watt mono block, you're going to have one channel output giving out 1000 watts. This is four channels, so divide 4000 by, sorry, divide four channels by 1000 watts, okay, you get 250 watts per channel. Now, the normal way that you wire up a sub is you go positive and negative to each of these terminals, okay, and that will be giving 250 watts to your speaker or subwoofer. Okay, bridging it, what that does is you use both channels with only two wires okay which doubles the power which puts it up to 500 watts maximum okay and it continues the same for these two now I'll just quickly show you my subwoofer okay it is an Eclipse uh, dual 12 inch um, competition series subwoofer okay what competition series means is every few years each brand brings out the very best technology to make their best subwoofer and they put it in the competitions to verse everybody else Okay, so competition series means it's pretty much the best uh, at that time. Okay, so these are 500 RMS, 1500 watt maximum. Okay, so they take plenty of power. Now, as I said, the amp is only giving 500 watts maximum. Uh, what I've done, because I've bridged it, i put all the power just into one. But, um, yeah, as you hear, it goes pretty good. All right, so as you can hear, that was going pretty well. Um, now, what I could do um, is bridge both subwoofers per channel one and two, but just with the stuff that I have, I'm unable to do it because I'm just running a standard uh, auxiliary jack from my laptop, which goes into two channel. Now, when you use a car uh, stereo, it has the rear um, and the rear left and right and the um, front left and right. So it gives out four channels, which means I can have four plugs going in instead of two, which means I can use all of the channels here, okay? Which means I'd be able to uh, have both subs going, which means it's going to be twice as loud. But, yeah, I'm unable to do that. But that's pretty much it. So I hope that helps um, and you understand how what the difference is between bridging and just normal. Cool. Thank you for watching.